we have this problem. It says you have 1,000 feet of fence to create a rectangular pin that is divided into four equal parts. Find the dimensions of the pin that will give you the most area. So we're looking for a maximum and we're also looking for area. So keeping in mind that area equals length times width. So that's what we need to build. So let's come over here and draw ourselves a little picture. It says we're making a rectangle. And we got to divide it into four equal parts. Um, so I might get something off here, but let's see. One, two, three, four. So it is in four parts here, the way I drew it. Um, so the way I have it here, I've got this one long length across the bottom. And I've got this width on the sides. Now we need to somehow write an equation in only length and width so that we can do our area. So what we know is we have two of these lengths, two L's, and then we have one, two, three, four, five of the widths. And if we add all that together, we're using a thousand feet of fence. So let's get one of these by theirself. Um, Let's say we get the um, L by itself. So we can say 2L equals 1000 minus 5W. And if we divide by the 2, we'll have L equals 500 minus, let's just go ahead and use a decimal, 2.5W. Okay, and that's the relationship between L and W based off of the 1000 feet. So when we come back and actually write a area function, area, we'll write it in terms of L. Uh, excuse me, we'll write it in terms of W. Um, the length we'll use is the representation we've got here, 500 minus 2.5W. And that'll be times W. So we wrote the length in terms of W. And that's what this whole thing was about. Okay. So we're going to clean that up. We'll distribute. So area is a function of width, but we'll have it, and I'll rearrange it. Um, we'll multiply the W times the negative 2.5W, so I'll have negative 2.5W squared. And then W times 500 would be plus 500W. Um, so when we talk about most, we're talking about the vertex. So in this case, that'll be W equals negative B over 2A. And my B is 500, so that'll be negative 500 all over 2A. Um, A is negative 2.5, so 2 times that will be negative 5. So if I divide that out, I'll have 100. So the width is 100. So if I come back and I use that number, the W way over here in the length formula, I can say that the length is 500 minus 2.5 times 100. And I believe that gives me 250. So the length is 250. So the dimensions that give this thing the most area are um, 250 feet by 100 feet. That's the dimensions we want. Um, if you wanted to find the area, you could just multiply those two together. All right. Thank you.